Getting started with ShowedMe can be done easily by following a few basic instructions. You will receive a text message with a link to the website along with your email and password. To log in, you must use the email and password we give you. You cannot use your own. Be sure to enter the password with the correct uppercase or lowercase requirement as the password is case sensitive. For example, if your text message shows your password as capital L, lowercase OG, capital I, lowercase N, you will need to type it in exactly as shown. If you have any questions, please feel free to access the live chat option on your screen. You can also email support at showedme. Upon login to the system, you should see any training items under your to-do list. Once you're taken into your learning path, you will see the overview on the left and a list of steps to complete in the middle column. You'll start with a completion percentage of 0% and as you complete each step, that number will change. As you begin going through each step, whether a video, document, etc., you must remember to click the Complete Step button in order to track your progress. As you click this button, a green check will appear for that step. That is how you know you completed the step and are free to move to the next step. If you do not see the Complete Step button, that's either because your step may have a timer that has not yet run out or the video is still playing. Wait until the timer and video are over in order for the Complete Step button to be enabled. Your training may have online forms for you to fill out. You will need to fill out all mandatory fields. If any mandatory field is not filled out properly, you will not be able to submit the form. When all fields are complete, scroll down and click on Submit. Once submitted, you need to scroll back up to the top of the page to select the Complete Step button. Be sure to scroll up to click Complete Step so that the green checkbox appears in your step and you are allowed to proceed to the next step. Another step in this learning path is an interactive course. This step requires the user to register for the course. Once you are registered by following the prompts for registration, you will be redirected to the videos for this course. Select the Complete Step button when done. There will likely be a quiz in our learning path to show that you are retaining the information that you're learning. You may be asked several questions where you'll be required to select the most appropriate answer. You'll be able to review your score at the end. If the score doesn't meet the passing grade, you will have to retake the quiz before being allowed to move on. Once you're done with all of the steps in your learning path, you'll likely need to add your signature as the last step. It will ask you to do so electronically. This signature shows that you have successfully completed your learning path and you'll be able to view your certificate at any later time. It will remain in your profile so that you or your agency can view it too. It can be printed as well, depending on you or your agency's preference. Here is a sample of a completion certificate. A nurse or DPS will sign it from your agency. You may be asked to sign it electronically as well. Once you're done, you're good to go until the next item on your to-do list is sent to you. This will depend on your agency's requirements. Good luck!